Welcome back to Dead End Gaming. I'm Dead End Dragon, and today we are talking about getting a crest in the game. Or at least getting a custom image in the game? I don't know, it kind of depends on what you want to do. You can do both really at the same time. Uh, so it's a bit of a simple process once you get down to it, but it's just a lot of steps, so it looks confusing. Uh, so let's break it down. So for the image, what you're going to want, it needs to be a specific size and file type and name. It's going to be 256 by 256 pixels. You can do that in Photoshop or any other equivalent. Uh, just make sure that you can get it into that resolution. And then you're going to need to save it or export it as a PNG file. This is important because it's the only file that the program will recognize. The next part you're going to want to do is go and title it UCC, all lowercase. That's important. I've had issues with it. I think it's supposed to accept it as uppercase, but just in case, you might want it to be lowercase. I know, lots of cases, huh? So after you've got your file, you're going to want to go to your C drive on your file explorer, and then you're going to want to go and go into Archage, Documents, and you'll notice that there's a folder called UCC. Place your file in there. Now, we'll go into the game, finally. Once you're in the game, you'll need to find a Crest printer. Uh, there are around, there's in lots of different areas, but uh, not every area I've found. What I have found, though, is they're at the main faction bases. There should be one there so that you can use. And like in the Solus Headlands or in Marianopol. Once there, you will also need to have a Crest Brainstorm in-game, and you'll also need some memory ink on the ready. We'll use the memory ink a little later. So let's get into using the Crest Printer. Once we have the Crest Printer up, you can use one of the pre-generated Crests on there, or you can use your custom image. That's probably what you're going to want to be using, uh, especially since we just got that in there. It'll show up in the bottom left-hand corner. If it's not showing up in the bottom left-hand corner, there's a step that's wrong, or it's not the right resolution, or it's not recognizing the file, or it's not in the right file destination. So maybe go back a couple steps. Uh, so once it is there, continue on. You can click it, and it will pop up on the screen, and you can make a little design with it. Uh, there is a background that you can put on it, but in most cases, I haven't really seen it be used. I think it's only used for the background part that you put on there is on for flags, or like on your sails for the ship. I think that's about it. Um, I'm not even sure if it's used a lot anymore. I'm not sure. But I usually just throw something on there every now and then just so I can kind of uh, keep them differentiated. Once you have it the way that you want, you can hit complete. Um, make sure to also follow the guidelines when putting your crest in. Uh, they ask for no copyright images or other things like that because that can get a little iffy and I can understand why. So for this case, we're using using my image. It's kind of cool. Now, nothing will pop up for a few seconds, but just give it like five, 10 seconds and don't touch anything. Don't move your camera. I found that that helps with the process. And then it should show up in your inventory within a few seconds. What we need to do with that is right click it. You will, Once you right click it, it'll take one memory ink and it will give you some crest ink. Now what that does is you, that's what you use on your pictures, on your sails, on your t-shirt, on whatever you want to use this crest for. And then you just imprint it on whatever you need. Every time you, you have to imprint it on something though, it takes memory ink, but you don't have to keep redoing it with a new crest brainstorm every time. You can just keep using the memory ink, which I think is brilliant. So I hope this helps you guys out. If you've made it this far in the video, feel free to leave a like. Let me It lets me know that you want to see more content like this. And subscribe if you definitely are interested in keeping up to date with more content and other things that the channel is posting. Um, and leave a comment below. What are you going to do? What kind of crest are you going to make? Uh, let me know in the comments below. I'm always interested in seeing what you guys are up to. So see you all next time.